here's some other thought for y'all um, for progressing your journey with horses. There are so many free and wonderful opportunities to keep learning. If you can't afford something at this time to go get a you know some lessons and even even lessons can be very reasonable for a trainer there are a lot of free opportunities there are podcasts you can get on spotify and you can find um train different training um podcasts you can go and find books some books might be online you can find books at a local library. A lot of local libraries may have a statewide system where you can check out other books from other libraries and it's sent to your local library. You don't own the book, but you still get to read it. Great opportunity. There are videos. Sometimes um, the same thing with libraries. You can get like DV training DVDs that will circulate. YouTube has tons. I've seen training videos, obviously shorter ones, but like on TikTok. There are live demonstrations on different Facebook groups. There are, um, I'm, I'm just trying to think of some off the top of my head, but in, our, in, in my last video, I talked about um, one of the podcasts I listened to by Phil Haugen and how he talks about if you're not growing, you're dying. And that is so true. The more I think about it, I'm like, man, he's, I always assumed he meant growing your business, but that's not always true. That means our life in general. If we're not growing, if we're not learning, if we're not progressing, we're dying. Meaning you need to get up off the couch and go attempt to do something. Quit playing the video games. Get off your phone. Now, I will say a real easy cheater method to do is if you watch a, let's say a horse training video on YouTube and you wanna try to take those same principles and apply them to your horse, set your phone up, hit the record button and try to stay in your phone's um, you know, view and record yourself working with your horse. Go back and watch that video and see if your hand position, leg position, body position, whatever, is the same as that training video that you watched. Because chances are, it's not the same. Chances are, as you were trying to work with your horse, you missed cues that your horse was showing you that then as you watch the video again, you might see. That's a real cheater and easy way to progress yourself, to realize, am I progressing? Am I getting any better or not? You can upload those to YouTube for free. Keep them private and go back and watch them. Do that even once a week, just once a week. At the end of the year, you'd have 52 videos to watch your progress. You can even open them and, and make them so that they're um, unlisted so that if somebody had a link, you can they can still watch it. Ask a friend for, for help. Critique, let them critique you. It's free and easy help. You just have to sometimes think outside the box in order to get it because I hear that all the time. People are always like, I don't have any help. I just gave you some free tips. So enjoy that. Have a great rest of your day.